Happy Tuesday, boys and girls. Welcome to my yoga studio here. Um, our exercise today is going to be um, really simple. All you are going to need to gather right now are some textbooks. Just books. It doesn't have to be textbooks. Any sort of books. I've got one, two, three, four, five. Five books right here. And we're going to be using these books as our weights today. Um, I think you guys are going to like this a lot. Uh, so just hang tight. We're going to jump around the house here doing different exercises, and I hope you all enjoy it. I'm going to pause right now to let you get a second to get these materials, and we'll meet right back here. So let's get started with getting that heart rate up. I want everyone to lift their hands up to the sky. Take a deep breath in. We're going to get ready to drop and do 30 seconds of mountain climber. So mountain climber, we're in a push-up position, and I want us to start one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Coming back up. Hands up to the sky. Bend down, try to touch your toes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's do another 30 seconds of mountain climbers. Standing up. Now it's a great time to go grab those books. Let's get ready for some core. Happy Tuesday, boys and girls. I'm going to start with a nice stack of books here. You can um, just, I've got five good law books here that we're going to be using for a good core exercise. And that's my dog Oliver in the background. Okay, so you want to start with a nice stack of those books up high. We're going to go into a V set just like this. If that's a little too hard, you can. Uh, put your feet on the ground. I'm going to kick mine up. We're going to go for one side. Once they get there, let's go back. If you want to make it easier, put your feet on the ground, kind of in a curl up position. Oliver's very interested in this. Next, you can take your books back, put them on the ground. Down, up, and down, up, and down, and we're going to do everything in reverse. Up to the pile, grab, up to the pile, grab, to the pile, grab, to the pile, one more, up, grab, to the pile. Next, same thing. I'm going to keep my feet on the ground a little easier. We're going to go right to left, right, to left, right, to left, right, to left, right, to left, and one more time, left, to right, left, to right, hello Oliver, left, to right, left, to right, left, to right, and take a quick pause. I apologize for that right there, uh, Oliver gets excited every once in a while. Hey, we're back up here. Uh, I want you to take your stuff, your pack, your stack of books, and put it right in front of you. I want you to get into a push-up position. Okay, let's just drop and hit the book once. Okay, now what I want you to do: pick up one book, take it back to your feet, pick up the next book, back to our feet. Notice what I'm doing right now is I'm alternating between the left and the right foot. Okay, now that all five of them are there. Switch hands and bring it back up. One, two, three, four, five. What I'm focusing on here, boys and girls, is a really flat back. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four, 
five. Again, switch hands. One, two, three, four, five. We're gonna do one push up. Hit the book. We're gonna sit. I want you to kind of wiggle those arms out. So one, two, do a little arm stretch. Three, four. We're taking our 20 second break here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. We're gonna get right back out of here. We're gonna do one push up. Ready? Right over the books. Push up down the books. Back in that push up position. What you're gonna do now, take your right hand, left, right, left hand, take it back to your right foot, then switch feet or hands. Take your right hand, go back to your left foot. So what we're doing is we're alternating every time. That's four, alternating five. And we're gonna bring these books right back to the Again, alternating our hands every time. We're gonna do one. Same thing. Alternating. Right now, you should be feeling it in some of your arm muscles, a little bit of our core. Almost done. You're almost at your break. Hang in there. Four and five. One push up. Standing up. Reach those hands up to the sky. Then down. We're taking a 20 second break. What we're going to be doing next is I want you to split. So we're going to be taking just one book. Pick one book, it can be the thickest book, it can be the thinnest book, up to you. I'm using about a medium sized book. Um, and what I'm going to be doing with it is using it as a weight, just doing some curl ups with it. Okay, that's one. We're going to do 20. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just take a quick pause. Take your breath in and out. In and out. Let's do ten more. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Taking that book, you can set it down. We go butterfly stretch here. This is our 20 second break. We're almost done. We only have one more exercise to do. So you're focusing right now on that breathing. Your heart rate should be up a little bit. Right now my heart rate coming at 136 beats a minute. Feel that blood kind of come into our brain. We're gonna repeat one of the exercises we started with. So you're gonna need all five of your books again. Okay? All five of those books, I want you to stack them right behind where your head is going to lay. I've got all five of them right there. And so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing a curl up. Grabbing the books up, setting it to my left, and down, curl up with the next book to my right. Curl up with the next book to my left. Curling up with the next book to my right. Curling up and back. And now we are bringing that right back 
and we're going to get started. And boys and girls, as you finish this video, if you still want a core challenge, my recommendation is to start the video all over again. If you feel like you've got a good core workout, just take one more deep breath in and out, and we'll see you tomorrow.